Chosen was Weyua, 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 Weyua. Chosen was back with another powerful and productive video, right? Great. This is about your sister and your brother who happens to be the firstborns in your family. Yes, if you are watching this video and you are a firstborn, this video is for you. You need to watch the entire video so that you understand the message I'm trying to put across. All right, great. And the way forward, all right, great. This is about firstborns, right? Um, if you happen to be a firstborn and your parents are not financially sound or financially independent, financially free, I mean, all right? Um, always, if you happen to be the firstborn, it's like the load of the family is on your shoulders. When mom, dad are not there, you are the one that will be acting as mom and dad for your other, other siblings, all right? Great, that is your other junior brothers and junior sisters, all right? Especially in Africa, if you happen to be the firstborn in a family, it's like your responsibility is so much. Yes, responsibilities on firstborn in Africa is so much in a situation or in a family where it happens to be like no mom dad are not financially independent free there is gonna be a lot of burden on you and sometimes this happens because you know you are the firstborn you are to bath your other siblings you are to take care of them in the absence of mom and dad you know and sometimes you uh, pick them from school, bring them back home and stuff, cook for them, watch for them, iron their things and a whole lot of responsibilities. Aside that, when you start to work, all right, the family is really going to depend on you, all right? Um, mom is going to be depending on you for some money. Dad will be depending on you for some money. Your other siblings will be depending on you for some money. All such things are going to come out of your account, especially when they happen to know about the amount of salary or the amount of money that you make at the end of the week or at the end of the month. All right. They do their budget according to, you know, the money that you will be receiving at the end of the month. And it's surprising. All right. Great. So if you happen to be a firstborn in your family, and you are being stressed up because of these financial issues and stuff, all right? Um, this is what I want you to do. As you're working, all right, for sure, there are going to be promotions and other things. When there are promotions and there is an increment in your salary, don't keep them in the known. Be low-key about certain things. And that is really going to help you. And sometimes you should let your no be no. Yes, if you don't have, let them know you don't have. And don't be stressing yourself over, over it. Because I know there is going to be so much stress on you. Sometimes you might even happen not to be a firstborn in the family, but you are the one that, you know, started working first. Sometimes in, in life, the, the firstborns are not necessarily the ones that start working, right? Start making money in the family. You could be second, third, or any number in the family, all right? But when you happen to be the first person that starts to work, it means the pressure is going to be on you, the stress is going to be on you. Because I know of many firstborns, ladies that are going through some stress, some depression right now, they, there is going, they, they, they feel downcast and a whole lot of stuff because of this pressure that is coming from dad that is coming from mom that is coming from their younger ones you know calling them from school i need this i need that and sometimes you know these people you know that uh, they, they are full of responsibility they happen to do other things and things they don't even want to do they got to do it to i mean just to get some 
money to be able to cater for the needs of their other other siblings. All right. So don't be stressing yourself. If you don't have, let them know you don't have. Okay. Don't be stressing you. You cannot be there just for everybody. You cannot be helping everybody. I know how tough it is, right? You cannot just be there for everybody. And firstborns, you know, sometimes when your parents are not financially free and financially independent, you know, um, it's like the firstborns, they suffer more because that is the time they will be, your parents will be struggling to make it. So you, you don't really, you know, get the ease the freedom you don't feel free you always always depressed there is so much pressure on you unlike sometimes the last born sometimes last born they are so blessed because by the time they give birth to the last one you know um your parent might have you know have achieved a lot of things maybe you'll be living in your own house driving your own your parents will be driving their own cars and other things too and they will even go and alight them at school drop them and pick them back from school and stuff and you know it's like last ones they enjoy all right great so if you are a firstborn don't be stressing yourself all right i know there is gonna be so much pressure on you all right don't be stressing yourself sometimes too you got to act low key it's gonna help you all right and it's not everything you should let your family know for instance the amount of money that you receive at the end of the month or every week or whatever don't let them know in details everything because they are going to be making their budget concerning the amount of money you've been making and that is going to stress you and you too you need to grow because no matter the level you are in life there is always another level to reach out for i'm telling you all right the top of one mountain is the bottom of another all right so climbing has no end we got to keep on climbing and that is how it is all right so it's like always your best is yet to come all right and if you allow yourself for your other siblings and other things to be draining you you know you are going to be stressed up and that is gonna lead to you know maybe shutting your life or something all right who knows okay so be very careful if you are a firstborn do what you can and what you can't, let them know, all right? Let them know how you're feeling. Let them know, all right? And sometimes your siblings, they also need to work. They also need to struggle. They also need to, because it is a way of building them up. It's, it's a way of helping them grow, all right? So you cannot just put everything on your shoulder and just be stressed up, all right? Great. If you are first born in the family, I pray for you. I pray for you, Father. I thank you for the life of all firstborns. I commit them into your hands, Father. There is a whole lot of responsibility on them. I pray, O oh Lord, that Father, you give them the strength. Father, you have made them the firstborn because you have equipped them for it. Strengthen them, O oh Lord. Help them, O oh Lord, in times of pressure and tension. Help them, O oh Lord, to be conscious of their faith in you to stay strong in you. Help them, O oh Lord, to be taking the right decisions in life. Help them, bless them, O oh Lord, open the door, the door of mercy, the door of favor, the door of breakthrough. As they hustle, as they wrestle, as they struggle, as they struggle to discover the next step to take, the next thing to do, O oh Lord, open the door, door of mercy, door of favor, door of breakthrough, breakthrough, breakthrough in their life. So that lord they will be able to take care of the others in the family oh lord i know that it is done in your mighty name thank you father father those that those that happens not to be firstborns but they happen to be the first people to start working to start earning money in the family i pray for them as well those that there are pressure on them on their finances in, in terms of supporting mom, supporting dad, supporting their younger ones, they have pure intention, pure heart for the family. They want the family to grow. Oh Lord, bless them. Bless them in a tremendous way. Bless them in a great way that they may be able, oh Lord,
to take care of their the other family members their siblings their mom and their dad bless them O oh lord open the doors of favor the door of mercy the door of breakthrough open the door of abundance in their life may they never lack O oh lord so that they will keep on doing the work O oh lord that you have put in their care in their hands O oh lord empower them strengthen them and see them through i thank you father for it is done thank you lord thank you so chosen ones that's it all right um let your yes be no yes okay it's not everything you can keep doing all right be free let them know certain things that you got to be low-key about it keep low be low-key about it and it's gonna help you okay yes it's gonna help you um, sometimes our problems are tongue what we say they are tongue troubles all right the tongue is what find problem for most of us right we want to say everything we want to tell everything you know and sometimes that get us stressed up that gets us depressed all right great but i tell you it's gonna be worth it keep on taking the right action keep on working hard keep on going the extra mile keep on having that pure heart and keep on putting god first in whatever you're doing and i tell you God is going to see you through. You're going to succeed because God knows the responsibilities on you. God will see you through. I pray God gives you the strength. God gives you the energy to keep on pushing and keep on going and never be tired. All right. Great. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video. I'm out for now. If you are a firstborn in the family and this is happening to you, let us know in the comment section. If you are not the firstborn in the family too, but... You know, you happen to be the first person working or the first person making some money, some significant amount of money, and there is pressure on you. Let us know how you're handling it, you know, how you're coping with it. And I tell you, others are going to learn from, you know, by reading your comments and they are going to learn from, you know, uh, the actions that you are taking, what you're doing that is helping you. All right. Let us know. All right. But I pray God bless you in a tremendous way because you are doing great work all right god bless you god see you true see you in my next video i'm out for now peace